To the U.S., Northern California residents living near the U.S.'s tallest dam ordered, were ordered to evacuate the area immediately. Authorities issued the abrupt evacuation orders in the mid-afternoon, saying that a crumbling emergency spillway on the Lake Oroville Dam could give way and unleash raging floodwaters onto a string of rural communities along the Feather River. State authorities and engineers began carefully releasing water from the Lake Oroville Dam late Thursday, 65 miles north of Sacramento, after noticing that large chunks of concrete were missing from a spillway. Water levels were less than 7 feet from the top of the dam as levels in the reservoir rose because of a California winter of heavy rain and snow that followed several years of severe drought in the state. California Governor Jeremy Brown asked the Federal Emergency Management Agency to declare a major disaster due to the flooding and mudslides brought on by the storms. So we're dealing with um, some soil erosion that is taking place on the emergency spillway. That is why we have upped the uh, We've increased the release of water over the main spillway to 100,000 CFS so we didn't have any more um, water coming over the top of the emergency spillway. That is the goal. Because when we had water coming over the top of the emergency spillway, it was beginning to erode the ground, right? And when you start to erode the ground and the dirt and everything else starts to roll off the hill, it starts to undermine itself. If that is not addressed and we don't take care of that and mitigate it properly, essentially what we're looking at is approximately a... 30-foot wall of water that would be coming out of the lake. Not the lake draining, but a 30-foot wall of water. That is why we took the appropriate measures that we did, and the sheriff did, and implemented the evacuation uh, process that, that we had going.